All right, another video. Let's go ahead and get into it. One, I know a lot of you been asking about also, T, when is the phone Rebel Flex going to hit the building? But guess what? We flexing right now for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Shout out to Phone Rebel for getting this over to me expeditiously. When it became available, man, shout out to them. They always looking out for the channel. But let's go ahead and take a look at the phone, 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 flex, phone Rebel Flex. <laughs> and let's check it out see what it has to offer. Now, you already know when it comes to phone Rebel packaging, you're going to get that classic packaging. So let's go ahead and, first of all, before we get into it, let's look at some things that's on the back side of it. 360 degree comfort. The Flex case is one of the most comfortable cases out there on the market. I will say that right now. CNC lens, anti-shock, strong magnets, ceramic coating, easy swipe in all directions, real aramid fiber. This one says uh, lightweight micro fiber couldn't read it i need some damn glasses and it comes with a 2.75d tempered glass screen protector so let's go ahead and get into it now i've already been into it i've already looked at it put it on my phone and flex is doing what it's always doing it's flexing its muscles man because this case is always a solid case now i know some it may be a thing to where this is like a personal preference some of you may not like this design but if you do the Flex is here, man. I'm thinking I might use this for a little bit. So first thing you're going to get in the packaging, of course, is going to be the Flex. Let's put that to the side. You are going to get that Phone Rebel 2.75D tempered glass screen protector. I already got one installed on my phone, and it's doing just fine. But if you got, you know, it comes with nothing. If you need a screen protector, it comes with it. Phone Rebel, put the installation frames in the packaging, though. People can't freehand install these screen protectors. There's a lot of us out here that's talented that can do it, but a lot of people, they're going to mess it up every time. So I would like to see an installation frame included. And just raise the price up a little bit if you got to, man. But throw the installation frame up there. And also, what is key when it comes to the phone Rebel Flex is going to be side protectors. Because if you don't know anything about the Flex, your sides will be open. You know how we got your head. We got your bottom. But your hips and your sides is going to be out when it comes to this flex. So basically what they give you, and let me go ahead and pull it out, are going to be very little strips of, you know, like silicone, little rubberish type plastic that's going to be able, like kind of like a film screen protector that's going to go along your sides of your phone so you don't have your sides exposed. Although they're out and they're exposed, they're covered up a little bit. And that'll help you against the little scratches and different things like that. So it's also good that they include these. They include two sets of these. So if you mess one up and by chance you might screw one up and start them because they are a little bit challenging. Now I'm not gonna do it on camera. Y'all let me know if y'all wanna see me do that a little bit later on, but they do include the actual side protectors. But let's go ahead and look at the main event and that's gonna be the Phone Rebel Flex. Now, of course, it looks very, very familiar to the Phone Rebel Gen 5 from the back of it because it basically is a Gen 5 except the size is chopped off. You know what I mean? Kind of give you a little, little bit more of a minimum feel. So let's go ahead. Top side, you're gonna see that Flex right there. On that back, you're gonna get two things that is, you know, that kind of stands out. Well, three things. Very nice air mid fiber weave you're going to get a cnc aluminum camera lens right here which phone rebel i'm not sure when it's going to become available everybody's asking me when are the accessories going to be available so you can switch out the camera lens right here you'll be able to switch that out for a different color and the little rebel branding right here you'll be able to pop this out and switch that out as well it's coming soon as soon as it comes soon i will drop the link or i'll probably do a separate video about it so you know that it's out and we'll get into it because you're flipping over on the inside you're going to get that soft microfiber layer that's going to protect the back of that phone but then you're going to see where you'll be able to screw those camera lens on as you can see right here and the, the little rebel logo that's just going to pop out accurate cutouts down below let's go ahead and get to the weight let's see what this case is looking like when it is uh weighed up always not a heavy case like i said the size cut off really reduces a little bit but 46 grams still a little bit still a little bit hefty when it comes to the weight category for the 15 pro max and the phone rebel flex so let's go ahead and grab that natty and the natty sides are about to be out man that is i really really like the feel of this thing right here so there it is phone rebel flex on the natural titanium let's go ahead and weigh it now phone and case we looking at 280 grams with the phone rebel flex and the iphone 15 pro max but let's go ahead and step around it so here are your sides it's going to be what the back looks like basically looks just like a gen 5 and on the sides you see your sides are going to be open your top and your bottom very familiar when it comes to closure so when it comes to that side we don't talk we don't have to talk about any buttons because all of your buttons are going to be exposed but 
I'm jumping ahead of the gun. I was already going to talk about how good it feels in him, but we can't jump to that part yet. We got to wait a little bit when it comes to that. But when it comes to the lay on the table protection, that's the first thing that we got to talk about. Now, even though you do get your sides kind of chopped off, as you can see, it definitely has pronounced corners on the side. You can see, you see that little raised lip all the way around it. Now, some people think that the Flex series doesn't really protect. Now, in case your phone falls on just a super uneven surface, yeah, but if it falls pretty on, the e on a pretty evenly surface, your phone is going to hit these areas before it hits the actual side. But I just say be careful. Anytime you have anything exposed, whether it's the top, bottom, sides out, just be careful when you're talking about dropping it because it could be a concern. But you are still good for lay on the tail protection. So when you set this down, it is still sitting on the case and not actually on the glass lens, the glass screen itself. So that's good that for this, it still has those claw corners that raise up a little bit so you'll still be protected and same thing back here with the camera of course i mean you know the camera lens is going to be raised up so you're definitely good there yes it does rock I always get some people in the comments ask me do it rock yes it is going to have to have a little bit of rock now how does the case the phone rebel flex fit on the actual phone i'm saying phone you need a phone counter every time i do a phone rebel case video but let's go ahead and check it out so of course we don't really have to answer to any flex because on the top and the bottom it is up there super tight there's no movement and of course we don't have any sides to choose from but one thing we can test out is going to be that pop on fit and that pop on fit is good like once this case is up there it's not coming off i took my camera on the case is not coming off it is a very tight fit as all phone rebel cases are you don't got to worry about having some sloppy loose fit the fit is going to be tight it doesn't move around or anything like that in the case actually feels very good now here is the one thing that a lot of people, this is the main reason for the flex that I think a lot of people miss. I know it's such a polarizing design having this all this protection and then the sides being super exposed, but let me tell you, man, let me tell you, holding this thing in the hand, this is what feels so comfortable because for me, I did not like the stainless steel sides when it came to the old iPhones. This titanium feels a lot better. Things are a little bit more rounded off. So therefore, when you hold this in your hand, it feels really comfortable. And for a second, it almost feels like you're holding just your iPhone. Now I know in your palms, you still have these sides kind of I'm saying it's not digging in your hands, but it, they're there and you can notice it. But holding it, it's just so comfortable because the sides are now on the sides are now so comfortable on the 15 Pro Max that I don't mind it being out. Like this case really, when I put it on last night, I really didn't want to take it off because it feels so comfortable. So definitely a nice move if you love your titanium sides. Some of you just may love those titanium hips. If you do, you might want to see them and you might want to caress them a little more. That's when you use the Phone Rebel Flex right here because it just makes the phone feel so comfortable in your hands. I don't feel like this case adds a bunch of bulk. I don't feel like it's that chunky at all. I feel like it's perfect for somebody who wants a protection. Say you may not want a super thin minimalist protection, but you want a little bit of protection but still keep things on the minimal side. I think that's exactly where the Phone Rebel fits right in when it comes to it. So let's go ahead and do a mag safe test. First thing, let's do, you know, Phone Rebel tends to pick up bases without the case in them, without the phone in them. Let's see if this Rebel uh, Flex has that going on. So you can do that. And yeah, it picks it up. The case itself picks it up without the actual, now it's not super strong, but it picks it up just fine with the actual phone in there. I know it's a lot of controversy going on right now with my MagSafe test, but guess what? It's the only using using the measurement I got. Maybe I might get a little scientific on y'all. Y'all let me know down below, but MagSafe works just fine. It pops on MagSafe, it works just fine. It's, all, well, it's already charged up, but it does pick this base up. It kind of picks it up. See, it's not super strong, but it will pick it up as it's struggling to pick it up. But you get what I'm saying. Just because the phone and the case combo does not pick this thing up, the case picked it up just fine. Maybe the phone is making it weaker a little bit. I don't know how all that works, but it still works just fine, everybody. Don't go running out on the internet overreacting because it doesn't. The magnets are fine for whatever you need, whatever use case that you need them to. The MagSafe magnets work fine. Let's just go ahead and do an example. If you have a wallet, I mean, you really, you don't need to be, you not shaking, I'm throwing it, and if it came out, it was going to hit you in the face when it comes to that. That's going to be an actual wallet. The wallet is up there good. Now, I'm not going to shake this MagSafe battery pack that hard, but 
This is a MagSafe battery pack, and I'm not holding back. Finally, you see what I'm saying? You really have to shake this thing for it to come off. So the MagSafe magnets up here are just fine. Don't you worry about it. It is good to go. So phone Rebel Flex. Let me look at the price point because I forgot the price and I forgot to get the price before I started the video. But the phone Rebel Flex is going to run you $45, $44.99 for the phone Rebel Flex. I feel like if you're looking for like a minimal style case, but yet you still want a little bit of protection, but then you want a little bit of customization to your case and you like what phone Rebel is doing. I always say the Flex is one of my favorite cases for the iPhone series. I love what they do. I love the design of it. I think it's unique. It's a lot of imposters out there who try to copy this design, but they just don't execute as well as Phone Rebel does. I definitely feel like if you like a Flex, you would not be disappointed this year with all the improvements that they made when it came to the Phone Rebel. It's the same thing, Phone Rebel Gen 5, same improvements with the Phone Rebel Flex, going to be one of the best out there. But if you need a little bit more protection, if your phone cases your lady and you don't like your lady going out the house with her hips out and her sides out, then go ahead and check that video of the Phone Rebel Gen 5. Easily going to be one of the top cases, top five cases coming up very soon when we do our top 10 cases, that video above.